William, we're going to get straight on to the calls. First Excellent. of all, we're going to speak to Helen. Helen, um, good morning to you. You got married and you had an issue with your bridesmaid. What happened there? Yeah, I did. Hi. Oh, hi. Yes, I, um, I got married four years ago and I had one bridesmaid and a flower girl. And I, the day went lovely. The night before... Sorry, it's my little one. Sorry. The night before... <laughs> Uh, the night before, I paid for the hotel, I bought her dress, bought her lovely bracelet to wear on the day, and the day went lovely, and then after the honeymoon, we got back, and we'd opened all the cards, and I suddenly thought, I don't think I got a card or anything from my bridesmaid. Looked through them, and I hadn't. Not a thing, not a dicky bear. <laughs> Did you ever talk to her about it? Um, well, I, I was a bit shocked, and about, I don't know, about a week after my honeymoon, she messaged me and said, how was your honeymoon? I thought, yeah, lovely. Thanks. I've got some lovely um, thanks for thanks for the day, and I've got some lovely presents and cards, and waiting for her to say something, and she just never mentioned it, and we don't speak. You <laughs> don't I was that, pregnant that, at the time. You, you don't fell speak. Out. Yeah, we don't speak. I, I was pregnant at the time. I don't know whether it might have been to do with um, the Hindu, because I had to kind of rein her in a little bit because I was pregnant, and I don't know if it was because of that or I'm not sure, but I oh, was um, gosh. Yeah, a bit gobsmacked. Oh, that's all gone horribly wrong. <laughs> I, isn't it? Oh, that's really wrong. sad. <laughs> yeah. But that's the thing, isn't it? I mean, the pressure of the big day, these things, cause things that then can affect you for the rest of your life. Yeah, the, I mean, w weddings are designed nowadays to irritate people. There's always somebody who's upset with something that goes on at a wedding. It's a shame. Who knows? The bridesmaid could have written a thank you letter that got lost in the post. These things do happen. Doesn't sound like it, though, does it? Probably not. If, you know, Helen, you were paying for, for everything for your bridesmaid, so you should at least have got a thank you letter at the end of it. But some sort of present uh, or a card. Yeah. What is, what is the usual thing. etiquette? What, uh, what's, what's accepted? For a bridesmaid? Yes. You know, it, it, I would go with something sort of mid, uh, mid to high end on the gift registry, if there yes. is one, or, a, you know, a sort of £70, pound, around the £70 pound mark, especially if everything, all the cost of being a bridesmaid is Was being covered. met by, by the bride, which it is in this instance. All right. Helen, thank you very thank you much.